Hello. Today, I'm going to talk about something that was really important to me when I went to Mexico for my vacation this year. We met a young man called Frederico Rocobono. His interest in corals was amazing. He gave them importance, and it was like they really mattered to us, and they would make a change. So, what are corals? Well, as you think, they're rocks, colorful and amazing rocks. Well, they are. They are structures made of calcium carbonate, AI, limestone. So they are the home to polyps, really tiny animals. Those polyps are in symbiosis with the algae zuhuzangsili, which is an algae that produces photosynthesis, which gives us oxygen and takes in the carbon dioxide. So those are almost all the reasons why we should care about them and why they're important not only to the underworld environment, but also to our economy and to our protection. You see, there's more than one or two. So if you still think coral is useless, think about it. What gas is essential to us living? Oxygen. And what do you want to produce because of global warming? Carbon dioxide. Well, those two things are each day provided and reduced by trees, as we know, by photosynthesis. Now, let's compare the amount of water on Earth compared to the amount of land on Earth. Well, guess the percentage. Just give it a guess. Yeah. It's about 70% of water compared to only 29% of land.